Jesus Christ to be saved. You can know you're going to heaven. The Bible says these things have I written unto you that you may know you have eternal life. And he that has the Son has everlasting life. He that has not the Son shall not see life, but the wrath of God abiding upon him. The love of God is through Jesus Christ. God's anger is when you reject his Son. When you reject his gospel. And you say, my way is better than your way, God. And Jesus said, I am the way. So when you tell Jesus no, you tell him, God, I am better than your son. Look how well I am doing, God. Look how good I am, God. When the Bible says there's none that do it good. No, not one. God never authorized religion and tradition to save you. God has never acknowledged religion to get you to Him. God has established in Himself through the Lord Jesus Christ the way of perfection, the way of holiness. And God said, Be ye holy, for I am holy. And you're not holy. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. And when you come short, you fall. And when you fall, you go to hell. And the Bible says, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. There's no other way. Man may have other ways. But that's, that's not, not the, the way, way of God. God. Tradition can't do nothing for you. I don't give a fuck how tough you are. The glory of God is Jesus Christ. The salvation of God is Jesus Christ. The life through God is Jesus Christ. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son that whosoever believeth in Him should not perish but have everlasting life. You are not saved. You're not secure. You're not saved without Jesus. You will face the wrath of God when you continue to reject Jesus and die without Him. A lost man goes into hell because he has continually rejected Jesus and never received Him when they die. 